Good evening, PA Figs here. My uh, wife was nice enough to bring a Desert King Braba up for me. So, uh, you can see here is the Desert King. It is sticky to the touch. And you can see there is uh, some good looking jam and sugar inside that eye there. So this is my first uh, Desert King Braba that I've ever had. It took a long time to ripen on the tree. It, uh, it, it sort of swelled and then stayed there and it finally uh, started to soften. Uh, I do not have my tripod with me. We're actually uh, on vacation. And I don't even have a knife, so I'm gonna have to tear into this one. So one second. Okay, and here's what the inside of the Desert King Brabo looks like. Nice and red. It looks like it's a little bit watery. We may have had a little bit of uh, rain the last day or two. But uh, let's see if I can pull it apart and see how it tastes here. It's definitely sugary. I mean, you can feel the, the stickiness of the sugar. And uh, it's wet, but it also seems to be, you know, real nice and jammy. So let's see. I'm hoping it's not too watered down. I wish I had a camera that could get real close up. All right, let's give it a try. Oh, that's very good. Mm. It is a little watery, but a real sweet, not really berry, just a, like a, a sugary fig taste. All right, let me have Teresa try it here. All right, Teresa, what do you think? Mm. It's watered down. Watered down. Yeah, it's watered down. Probably got a lot of rain here the last day or two, but it's it's got a nice sweetness to it, a nice flavor. It's very mild, yeah. but uh, I can see why people like it, and it's very early. This one didn't get a head start, and it's uh, July 12th, and it's ripening. So, Desert King Braba, you know, pretty nice fig. So, uh, I'm PA Fix. Have a good night.